The United Nations has announced that it is urgently appealing for about three billion US dollars to finance humanitarian operations in Sudan after fighting broke out in the country. The UN humanitarian agency said it needs two point six billion US dollars to help those who are still within Sudan, saying twenty five million people in the country are in dire need of humanitarian aid and protection. The global body earlier noted that more than a million people had fled the country as fighting between the army and rival paramilitary rapid support forces rages. Ramesh Rajasinham, head of the UN Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs in Geneva and director of the Coordination Division, said the fighting in Sudan has been cruel blow to the people of Sudan. He said the conflict has left at least 676 people dead, with the actual toll likely much higher than what has been reported. Another 400 million US dollars of appeal came from the UN Refugee Agency to help those who have fled to neighboring countries to escape the fighting in Sudan. Intense battles in the capital Khartoum and other cities of Bahri and Omdurman continue despite Saudi-US brokered negotiations between the army and the RSF in Jeddah aimed at securing humanitarian access and a ceasefire. The arrest has caused many countries to evacuate the diplomats, officials and citizens from the embattled African country. Kamel Sadiq, reporting for CPA TV.